Ivo. And Balotelli's in the clear. And onside. It's Mario Balotelli. 2-0! Defense by the Hawks, good team defense. Sackhouse finally makes his way to the goal. Weatherspoon gets it up. Press 24 for the Sixers as Clarence tries to jam his way. A can against the tumbo and Dikembe says no. Clarence and the tumbo. No, no, no. The tumbo shook his head. Yes. Certainly made for either of them. Harlan's had some nervous moments from shots, and he's beaten again. Oh, he just stands and waits for his teammates to come and congratulate the master. That seems perfect. Anything that hits the woodwork and ends up in. Just how late does he see it? That doesn't make any sense to me. Unless he thinks he can entice Kobe Bryant to get thrown out. He <laughs> did. Either that or... There's no way he's going to intimidate, and now a two-shot foul because the foul occurred before the ball was inbounded. Tony Brothers now telling It should have reset. No, no, the, I can't believe that. Fortunately, you know why Paul shot it? The shot clock should have reset. It hadn't reset. And when he looked at it, he let it go. How far was that? He was about five steps behind the three-point line. Paul George, he had feet on the center circle. He really wants him to run, he said, especially with Kyle Korver on the court. To press the tempo of this and to please take care of it. to his right. Foul. Repcar. Uh oh Cards coming out. Number two, Repcar. Pushed away angrily by Davids. He's been booked. Uh oh Finger pointing here. Referee right on the spot. And Davids won't leave it alone. In fact, the referee is pushing Repcar away. Well, it's a certain hand on chest there. Offensively, they just keep fighting back. Seven on answer for the Summit Sixers. Iverson bothered by Lewis. Iverson. Oh. Yes. How about that? And that's that's
Stenhouse has got it. Give it back to Michael. <laughs> Fake on the tree. <laughs> 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 and, uh, I have to laugh. He did that to me in the All-Star game, so I feel your pain. We saw an enormous accident. This is what we saw. Eric Comas coming through the second part of Blanchemont. Flat out in sixth gear, something like 180 miles an hour. And that was Ed and Senna going into the dust behind him. But Senna was the only driver to stop, get out of his car, and go and see what condition Comas was in. But a very, very big shunt, very high speed shunt. You can see the marks on the road. The car rotated at least twice. That took a lot of the speed away from the car before it hit the end of the tire wall. But a big impact for Comas. He was momentarily stunned, knocked out. But by the time the marshals got to him, he was beginning to come around. He was taken out of the car, taken to the medical center at the circuit. From there, he was taken to hospital for the obligatory... Tommy Smith, Etats-Unis, 19 secondes, 8 dixièmes.